Hello everyone, welcome to Ms. Lavish, a channel for awesome facts and information. In this video, we are going to talk about the top 10 richest kings in Africa with a current net worth, 2021. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel Ms. Lavish for future uploads. Riches and royalty go hand in hand. It is a rare phenomenon to find a poor ruler. In the 21st century, rich African kings earn their wealth from government taxes, community donations, businesses, inheritance, and other ventures. Their net worth is estimated based on the assets held after accounting for debt. In Africa, kingship is still very common as the head of every cultural setting. Gone are the days when kings just used to sit in the palace and control the affairs of the subordinates. Kings now have businesses they run, and a solid source of wealth which is what we would be talking about today. Here is a look at the top 10 richest kings in Africa in 2021. Number 10. King Goodwill Zwelithini of Zulu, South Africa, net worth, $19 million. The Zulu reigning king was born on 14 July 1948 in Nangoma, South Africa. He ascended to the monarch position in 1968 after his father, King Cyprian Bikuzulu, passed away. Zwelithini was the longest-serving Zulu king in history, reigning for more than five decades. His role was largely spiritual and ceremonial, and although he had received criticism from South African authorities, he kept his popularity among the Zulu people. The Zulu ruler gets an annual allowance of $6 million. He also receives grants and other luxuries from the South African government, which are deducted from the country's revenue. Number 9. Osagiefuo Nana Amoesha Afori Panin of Akiyama Abuakwa, Ghana. Net worth, $28 million. Nana Amoesha became the 35th king to ascend the Okiman Afori Panin stool on 4 October 1999, after the passing away of Osagiefuo Kuntunkanunku II. Okinhene Osagiefuo Amoesha Afori Panin is the reigning paramount chief of Akiyama Buakwa, an ancient traditional area in the eastern region of Ghana. Since his ascension, he has been advocating for economic and commercial development as well as the general welfare of the people of Akiyama and Ghana in general. Number 8. Togbi Afid 14 of Asagli State Ghana, net worth, $30 million. The Agbogbomafia was born on 23 April 1957 as James Okpo and was coroneded in October 2003. He holds a business administration degree from the University of Ghana, and an MBA from Yale School of Management. Togbi is a great investor and holds the following titles. Current Executive Chairman of the World Trade Center Accra. A board member of several companies. He established SAS Finance Group Limited which consists of SAS Investment Management Limited and Strategic African Securities Limited. He established a private equity investment company called Strategic Initiatives Limited, SIL. Co-founder of Africa World Airlines Limited, Sunan Asagli Power Ghana Limited, and Databank Financial Services. The majority shareholder in Accra Hearts of Oak FC. Number 7. Otumfuo Ose 222 of Ashanti, Ghana, net worth, $40 million. Otumfuo Ose 222, whose birth name is Nana Barima Kwaku Dua, was born on 6 May 1950. He began his reign as the Asante Ene of the Ashanti people on 26 April 1999. The ruler is the Chancellor of the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology, NUST, the Grand Patron of the Grand Lodge of Ghana, and the Sword Bearer of the United Grand Lodge of England. In the 1980s, Ose 222 started a mortgage finance firm called Primota Financial Services Limited, which is located in northwest London. In 1989, he established Transpomec International, Ghana, Limited, a mining equipment provider in Ghana. He also has a massive collection of valuable gold crown jewels as well as real estate properties in South Africa and Ghana. Number 6. Oba Rilwan Akiolu of Lagos, Nigeria, net worth, $40 million. Oba of Akiolu of Lagos is a law graduate and a retired assistant inspector general of the Nigerian police. 
The Oba, King, of Lagos is the traditional, yet ceremonial, sovereign of Lagos, a coastal settlement of Yoruba people and Nigerians that went on to become the largest city in Africa after first giving its name to Lagos State, the financial heart of contemporary Nigeria. Oba Rilwan Akiolu was born on 29 October 1943 and was crowned the 21st Oba of Lagos in May 2003. He is a law graduate from the University of Lagos. He served in the Nigerian police force for 32 years, where he ascended to the position of Assistant Inspector General. Number 5. Obi Inameka Alfred Ugo Chukwu Achebi of Anitsha, Nigeria, net worth, $50 million. Obi of Anitsha, Nigeria is a prominent king in eastern Nigeria. Naemka Alfred was born on 14 May 1941 and emerged as the Obi of Anitsha in May 2002. The Obi of Anitsha is the traditional leader of Anitsha, Anambra State, Southeast Nigeria. The post of the Obi is recognized by the state and federal governments of Nigeria, and the Obi himself is seen as a representative of the people of Anitsha to the state and federal levels of government. He is one of the most prominent kings in eastern Nigeria. Inameka is currently the Chancellor of Amadu Bello University as well as the Chairman of the Board of Directors of Unilever Nigeria. The Obi also serves as the Chairman of International Breweries, Nigeria. Number 4. King Swati III of Swaziland, net worth, $50 million. King Swati III is the last absolute monarch in Africa, and he earns a salary of $50 million. The King of Eswatini was born on 19 April 1968 in Manzini as Makozativ. He took the crown on 25 April 1986 at 18 years old, thus becoming the world's youngest monarch to rule at the time. He is also the last absolute monarch in Africa. The head of the Swazi royal family gets an annual salary of $50 million, which is deducted from the government treasury. He is also in charge of an investment holding company called Tibio Taka Nguyen that has assets valued at over $140 million, which he holds in trust for the people of Eswatini. As of 2020, he has 15 wives and is known for leading a flamboyant lifestyle despite the high poverty rate in Swaziland. Number 3. Sultan Saadu Abubakar III of Sokoto, net worth, $100 million. Sultan Saadu of Sokoto is the most powerful traditional leader in northern Nigeria. Saadu was born on 24 August 1956. He served in the military from 1977 and retired in 2006 as Brigadier General. He became the 20th Sultan of Sokoto in November 2006 after the death of Sultan Mikado on ADC Airlines Flight 53 crash. Saadu is the most powerful traditional leader in northern Nigeria, and is the Nigerian head of the Islamic religion. Number 2. Oba Frederick Obateru Akinrutan of Yugbo Land, Nigeria, net worth, $300 million. The Olugbo of Yugbo Land was born in 1950 and became king in 2009. He has an estimated net worth of $300 million, which makes him the second richest African royalty and the wealthiest in Nigeria. The king owns Obot Oil, a leading privately owned oil company in Nigeria. He also owns an extensive portfolio of residential and prime commercial real estate property in Nigeria and London. Number 1. King Mohammed VI of Morocco, net worth, $2 billion. The King of Morocco, a member of the Alawite dynasty, was born on 21 August 1963. He was crowned king in July 1999 after the passing away of his father, King Hassan II. As of 2021, King Mohammed VI has an estimated net worth of $2 billion, making him the richest king in Africa. His palace's daily operating budget is estimated at $960,000. King Mohammed VI is a successful banker and businessman in Morocco. The royal family is the majority stakeholder in Société Nationale d'Investissement (SNI), one of the largest investment holding companies with a diverse portfolio. The king also owns phosphate reserves, extensive land, and is a leading agricultural farmer in Morocco, where agricultural activities are not taxed. 
That's pretty much it for today's video. Do you find this video interesting? Do let us know in the comment section below. We hope you've enjoyed it and collected some useful data. If yes, then please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel Ms. Lavish for more informative videos. Don't forget to turn on the notification by pressing the bell icon, so you never miss our future uploads. We will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, goodbye.